Hey guys, it's the Clumsy Geek, and welcome back to Factorio. In the previous episode, we worked on this area right here, where we created these labs and automated the creation of the Science Pack 1. So now we have most of the stuff in research completed, like you can see all these green items, except for these guys here, which need the Science Pack 2. So in this episode, we're going to focus on how to automate that stuff. Now, that is getting a bit more complicated. Actually, something just finished, not sure what. But let's finish all those items which do not need any science pack to, and that only is this one. Everything else needs science pack to, okay. Just so something is moving. So that science pack to thing is a quite complicated thing to build. If you look here, it needs one inserter and one transport belt. It looks really simple, just two items, but when we craft, we need to deal with the raw ingredients and create the intermediate ingredients one by one. So what I mean is, if it says here inserter, then we have to create the inserter from scratch. And to do an inserter, we need an electronic circuit and an iron gear wheel and one iron plate. The gear wheel and the iron plate we have, because the gear wheel is over here and the iron plate is over here, but the electronic circuit we have to create manually again and that requires one iron plate and three copper cables and in turn to create a copper cable we need one copper plate so you can imagine the the number of uh, steps in order to reach this inserter and finally make a science pack too so that sounds like a pretty complicated contraption right there and i guess we will need all the space we need so what I'll do is I'll clear this, and by the way, you can clear this by just hovering your mouse in it, and C is the default button, so you can just shoot it like this. So I'll go ahead and clear out this stuff here, these trees, I'll clear, so we can have all the space we need. And I'll think of a design, and then I'll be right back, guys. Wish me luck. Okay, so I was able to clean this place up a bit. No more trees, no more stones, and we can start, but before we do, Let's just clean this place up. So what I wanted to do was remove these labs and uh, ensure that these guys here continue producing science packs, even though the lab doesn't need them anyway. Like even there, if there is no research, I want the building to continue. So how we do that is we uh, just make belts here like that. Yeah, and build some inserters right there. and then plop down these labs in the same way. Just a few cells below, like this. And one more. Perfect. We just need... Someone's attacking. It's okay. There and here. Perfect. All right. So now, these guys should all have science packs. Perfect. And even though they're not using it, Science pack production is completing. And we'll be making use of that later on. I'll show you in a bit. But now we can build the science pack 2 automation. And that needs an inserter and a transport belt. Transport belt, we actually have everything we need already. Because this guy over here was building since the start of this mission. So we have all of those that we need. And then... We just need inserter. Now the inserter is quite complicated as I showed earlier. We need one circuit, one gear, and one iron plate. But in order to make a circuit, we need one iron plate and three copper cables. So let's start with, and in order to build copper cables, we need copper plate. So let's start with this guy here, copper cable. How do we do that? Well, we just need to... Hmm, build something here, like this maybe, and make an inserter right here, and tag that to make copper wire. Does that work? Yes, but it doesn't have power, so we just need to put power in there, like so. Alright, I'm happy with that. So now there is copper wire production. Now we need to make the electronic circuits, and that is by 
combining the iron plate and copper cable. So we have iron plates here. So basically we could just transfer that over here. Like have you transfer the copper wires from here to here and the iron plates transfer from the top to this assembly machine here. At least that's the concept. But if that will work, we will see soon enough. So let's put one more pole there. And this guy needs to be this one. And it looks like it's working. Yes, all right, great. So we now have step two, which is the electronic circuit. Now we need to combine the circuit, the gears, and the iron plates. And in order to do that, we cannot just use assembling machine one because if we look at it, assembling machine one can only craft up to two ingredients. But the inserter needs three, circuit, gear, and iron plate. So we actually need the next level, which is assembling machine two. But no problem, we have all the things we need for that. So let's create one here. Let us put in a post, right? Maybe, I don't know, maybe here. Yeah, let's put that on later. But what we need is a gear. So gears can be retrieved from here. Yes. And then iron plates can be retrieved from here. Huh, how do we do this? So maybe if I do it like that. And then like this. Will that work? No, let's do it like this. There we go. Okay. So this guy, we just transport from there to there. And whatever is built here, which is the electronic circuit, we transfer from there to here. And we just need electricity. Right there. All right, everybody happy? Now, when we trigger the inserter, it should build up pretty nicely. Like that. So everything we need is there. Perfect. And now we just need it to be transferred once again in here. There we go. <laughs> cool, right? All right. And then the last step is building the actual, what do you call that? Science pack two, an inserter and a transport belt. So inserters are here. The transport belts are here, but we can just get that because we have a full crate of that. So I can just get the entire chest <laughs> and just transfer it here. Just to make things simple. So what we just need is one assembling machine here. Like that. And put in a chest like right here. Maybe. Yeah. And just put in one more of those in there. And the belts, I'll put everything inside this one. <laughs> a quick fix. And then if we tag this guy to make science pack two, there we go. Now it's creating, perfect. And then we just need to transfer that from here to here, I would guess. Yeah. So whatever you build there, transfer to this belt. And then transfer here, like that. Will that work? Let's see. Okay, the only problem is the science pack 2 is being transferred to that area, to the bottom part, which we don't like. So, we need to transfer this. Huh, how do we do this? I think we can do some trick here. Let me try and figure that out. Okay, so, hmm. So I guess if we need it to be on the top layer here, we have to rotate this somehow. Let me see. If we remove this guy here and transfer instead from here and then from there and then to here. So theoretically, this inserter should transfer. Let's put in something there. So it will transfer everything and it will transfer this guy would transfer to the right side of the belt because that's how it works. It transfers to the farther side and not to the nearer side. So in concept, if we do it like this, perfect, now it's on the right side. And now we just need to link this up. Uh, like 
that. Perfect. Okay. And now, we just need to research. Logistics 2, I would guess. What's needed in the automobile? Logistics 2 and engine. Okay, so let's take that. Let's make engine first. Yeah. There we go. Look at that. So now this guy is starting because there was a science pack there. And this guy would get that. Perfect. And this guy is starting. So as long as we have enough belts here, we should be good to go. And I don't think we'll be running out anytime soon. <laughs> right? So let me transfer actually. Yeah, that should be fine. That should be fine. So let me just wait for this guy to finish. And uh, we'll finish the research of engine and automobile or logistics too. And then I'll be right back. But this is working pretty nicely. So I would guess this guy should get that. Huh, we might need to speed this up though. This is kind of slow. So we might need two more or one more at least. Hmm. Let me think about that. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so this won't do. This is working fine, but it, it's very slow. So we have to speed this up. Like, this guy here is not enough. Just makes one at every few seconds. So we have to multiply the power of that. So what we can do is just clean this up and... Make sure that this, because this is where the bottleneck is. Like up to this point, we have everything we need. Okay, so let's start from there. Uh, let me remove that and this guy. And then what we can do actually is change this up. So let's see. Instead of making things and transferring that from here, we can transfer that to here. And then put in a belt right oops right there. Not sure how long it would be. That like that. And then put in some power. Um maybe something like this should be enough. Alright. So that will put inserters on the top layer. And then we just need to put in a chest here. Put in all the belts inside. Uh, who is attacking now? Can you manage? Yeah, you can manage. And then put in inserters there. And that should put, perfect, the belts on the bottom layer. And now we have two main ingredients to create the science pack too. And from there, we just transfer that to here. Oh, and we actually need lots of assembling machines more, like maybe two more. Yeah, let's make that five even. All right. And then we can put that maybe in here. Should be fine. Like one. Just to make it look nice. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. And then let's extend the belt this way. Like that. Transfer things from here to here. Like so. And then transfer the electricity to this spot. Arr. <laughs> okay, and then we can do a copy paste, like assign one like that. And then shift right click, shift left click to everyone. Now everyone is moving. And everyone is building science packs. Alright, good. Now we have five times faster production compared to the one earlier. And then what we need to do is transfer all of those to the belt all right and this one maybe let's put it here <laughs> it's gonna be ugly let's fix that let's make it all consistent and pretty you 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 and you perfect so let's just put in a belt there okay the problem here is there is no electricity <laughs> but aside from that the problem here is that, hmm, let's see, if you go down, right, 
there, you would be on the left side again. And if we just connect that here, it would be on the bottom side. But we want these guys to be on the top side right here, right? So we have to mix it up. And we can do the trick like in here, in this spot for the gears. Like look at that. Regardless if the gear is created from the left or the right side, it will transfer from the belt here and it will connect to this separate belt here. And it will always be on the left side now. Neat trick. So we can apply the same thing just in a different direction. So we apply, we create a belt from here, going down like this and connecting there. And then this guy, we extend one, but we connect to this side. And look at that. It gets transferred from the left to the right side, thanks to that technique. And now we should have all the science facts we need. Perfect. I'm happy with that. <laughs> nice. Cool, I like it. Let's just extend this to look pretty. Okay. Now, is there any other bottleneck? I don't think so. Is this guy creating? Oh, okay. So the inserters are kind of slow, but we don't really need that fast because these guys have everything they need so far. Yeah, so there's, there's buildup there already. So we're fine with this. And now it's just a waiting game. So I'll go and wait this out. I'll go and repair some of the stuff in here. Yeah, and I'll be right back when we're done with this. See you guys in a sec. Okay guys, we're almost there. Automobilism, perfect. And now we have everything we need to make the car. No, actually, we just unlocked it. But we need to craft it and place it. To build that, we need this guy here. We need eight engine units. And to build an engine unit, we need steel plates, gear wheels, pipes. And we have to make that in a level two or three assembly machine. Like this, assembling machine. But... Uh, yeah, I guess that's going to be it for this episode because we're out of time. So in the next episode, we'll make a car and we'll drive it around, hopefully. Uh, assuming that we're able to make it correctly. <laughs> All right. And in the meantime, before I go, I just wanted to show you this. So I got tired of uh, loading the ammo manually to these gun turrets. So I automated it a bit. And it's just really a simple thing because the ammo is really easy to make. Like just one, two iron plates there. So I just have an... An inserter here. Oh, there's battle. Oh, no, it's done. <laughs> so iron plates get transferred here. Build ammo and transfer that all the way here to the where the gun turrets are. And just inserters there to feed them. Really simple, but very useful. Just perfect for lazy me. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did like it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more updates. So this is the Clumsy Geek signing off. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a nice day. Bye.